hello lovely people welcome back to the channel to my new subscribers thank you very much for coming and joining this family for my returning subscribers thank you so much for always um watching my videos always liking my videos and i really appreciate that and i don't take you for granted so today we are going to talk about this submersible water pump guys we've been having trouble getting water from the underground tank to the tanks at the top of at the rooftop because we normally we used to we were using the normal pump but uh, we realized that of, of course it was not the proper pump for um, pumping water uh, to the tanks you know at the rooftop but um it is what we had and that is what we're using but we didn't know we are going to install the submersible water pump at this moment because it is something that uh we we were, we were planning for it but we thought that we're going to do it um towards the tail end of the construction but we had to do it because uh most of the time we want to use water and the water does not have a lot of pressure because there was no water inside the tank because the initial pump just the normal pump that we were using was not doing the work very well so most of the time the tanks were empty so we decided to buy this water pump from davis and shutliff so um that's just the plumber trying to fix it because we went we are going to uh drop it inside the underground water tank and it's going to stay there as long as there is water so the plump is just trying to fix the uh, you know the pipes and everything and it's going is going also to connect it to the this is a pipe in the tank that he's going to um connect it to so he's just trying to um you know fix all these things but uh, as of now since we don't have electricity we are going to pump the water using the generator but you see for the other pump we all we only bought fuel and then we were able to pump the water but since this this uh, submersible pump is supposed to be using electricity and we don't have electricity for now we are going to use the generator to help us pump the water up to the tanks at the rooftop so of course those are, those are the electricians they're trying to route the um route the wire the electrical wire to the wherever the software the socket is going to be so it is a concerted effort it's an effort that um you know it involves a, a lot of people but at least we'll have the headache of getting water at at the top of the at the rooftop or at the getting water you know the 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 stress of getting water uh, at the rooftop or at the tanks at the top is going to you know end from this day so uh, of course as i say the electricians are trying to just route the wire for the pump so that we can be able to pump it so that is it they're trying to um uh you know submerge it is, is it submerge or what they're trying to put it inside the water tank and this guys this this pump is quite heavy you might see that it's a very small pump but it is so heavy you know one person could not uh, be able to drop it in the water you, you don't know um uh it had to be um you know dropped by the collaboration of a number of people so it is already inside the water and this is the storm water that we got during um from the from the rooftop because we are we are collecting the storm water when it rains we do collect so this is water that we collected during the month of april when um the it rained heavily and that is what we are using up to this moment and at least it's been serving us because the water in this area uh we are served by bohol water and you know bohol water is somewhat hard so yeah guys look at the pump it's already submerged inside the water so they when you look at it closely but of course uh, there's some disturbance in the water tank but at least you can see it. it's already submerged and it's going to stay there as long as you know as long as it's required to stay there unless maybe it needs to be serviced and all that that's when maybe somebody uh can open the tank and not somebody but the plumber can open the tank to just service it but as for now yeah i can see the um is it the floating valve the blue the blue thing there yeah so that blue wherever is supposed to when the tank uh at the rooftop is uh filled the, with water the two tanks are filled with water that uh the switch is supposed to um you know uh switch off the pump automatically you know that is how it's supposed to work so it was so hard you know it was a very hard task for the plumber to uh, fix this pump because our initial plan was to use the storm water here and then when it uh, it gets finished 
we wash the tank and uh you know that's when we bring the pump to just fix it so you know uh, the plumber and all the guys involved had, had to go through this trouble because uh there's still water in the tank and they couldn't get inside the tank because as i said getting a pump was was it was in our plan but it was something that we were supposed to do at the tail end um of the project because even the guys at the construction site you know they knew they had their ways of uh drawing water from the tank so we wanted the water to get finished so that uh, uh we wash the tank so that then we bring in all the pump and all that but now since uh, getting water at the um, tanks has been a uh, quite a task we decided okay let's just let's just get the pump and fix it so that at least we can have we can get water more easily as compared to how we've been drawing the water so we are waiting for uh, when the water when we are, we have used the water and the tank is drained that's when we'll, we'll have a chance to wash the tank and maybe uh fix one or two things but right now since we need the water we had to you know bring in the pump and just fix it that that's why you know it, it it was kind of difficult for them to fix it because normally they could have just gotten inside the tank but since this, the tank has a lot of water they can't get into the tank now so they have just to devise ways of making sure that they connect the pump to the pipes uh very well yes so that is just the update for um today at least um we'll be having water for now even in the bathrooms you know uh, at least uh, even just the taps around we'll we'll not have to you know uh, open the tank lid to get the water and draw the water as you know by dropping um buckets in the well so the already fixed it's in there so um the electricians are just trying to do their work so that we can be able to pump the water using the generator over here and of course now this one because the, the pump is meant for um the submissible pump is meant to you know for this kind of of work it's going to take a very short time to fill the tanks up the rooftop so um so uh the plant is just trying to check whether uh, at least water is going up the tank and they confirm that water is going up the tank so everyone is happy everyone our problems have been solved so just look at the water the way it's getting in with pressure so thank you so much and i hope that you've enjoyed the video please like subscribe and share the video and but for now bye bye and see you in my next video